guys, I'm James Sinclair and this is Backstage Business. And we are here at Mars Farm. It's just one of the businesses that we own and you guys get to watch this show every day and learn entrepreneurial stuff. This is Mars Farm. Guys, you've just seen that fantastic drone footage that we put in there. And there's a reason that we're putting drone footage into our vlogs. You might think, oh, what's that got to do with business? But I'm very, I suppose the more years I've uh, notched up in business, I've realised the more that people copy you. They can get the ump about that. And I, I speak to lots of business owners and entrepreneurs. They get the ump, oh, this person's going to copy me. I don't want to employ a manager because they could copy me and do the rest of our business uh, and then take clients away from it. That's, like, that's a constant worry uh, about uh, business owners employing people taking all the best ideas and stuff right that's a, a real thing that I just have to you know as a, a successful business owner uh, that we need to you know get over that but how can you get over that because it is a constant niggle even to me it's a constant niggle Chudlington even to me so we're gonna make your business less me too less me too that's what we got to make it look at me chuds we've got to make it less me too you can put the words in and, uh, and that's what I really strongly believe so putting a drone into a vlog what does that make Make it less Chuddlington? Me too. Less me too, because not everyone, I mean everyone can do motivational videos or business videos on Facebook and Twitbook and uh, Tube you. all of those things, they can all have those things, but by putting a drone in, not everyone's doing that. We've made our videos, all of a sudden, less me too. And there's, you know, only one of me, so that makes it less me too. And there's only one of you, Chuddlington. So Chuddlington plus drone plus James Sinclair equals successful vlogging. Something we've done here, we do pumpkin picking. We were the first sort of in Essex to grow our own pumpkins. People come along, pick their own pumpkins. You know, that was, we done that four years ago. Now everyone's doing it, so it's not as, you know, more people are doing it. So we've got to think of other ways of making things less me too. And that's why we're building a train going around our Christmas experience. Because that's less me too. And we've got a life-size giant polar bear. That's less me too. Not everyone can do that. So I think a top tip for business success, if you're worried about those things, don't think people are going to copy you. Think about how you can be less me too. How can people do things that you know, that can't copy you. Now, lots of people, like this vlog thing, Chudders, people in our space, in the business training space, they started doing vlogs. When I started doing vlogs, we're now on episode 95. And those little honey bunches, those little cupcakes, only got to sort of episode four and five, because I thought, this is hard work. So consistency and effort can make you less me too, gang. And that is something that we can all do. Putting a bit of effort into vlogging, doing it consistently every day, then putting in the drones and all the microphones and having a cameraman, that's just the next step and really dotting the I's and crossing the T's. But consistency and effort are the ones that really make you less me too. If you do something consistently with a lot of effort, you know, you'll beat a lot of people. But always try and think how you can make your business less me too. And that gang, that gang is a real big wrap up of this backstage business. And I think we'll be nice chudders if we put some nice instrumental music and put some more drone footage over the end of this video just to show off that we are droning in our vlogs now. Bonjour.